Hello again and welcome back to Bantam Battles, solo war games and RPGs with a small footprint. This is log number eight, Robert Max here. And in this episode, we have a after action report and wrap on Bugship, a micro RPG created by Noah Patterson at Micro RPG last year, 2020. Well, as you can see, Rex Ripley did not get very far. We did not exit the first room. We were unable, or he was unable, to clear out the four bug guards, their life points of five, plus the fact that the room was darkened. That added a one to both strength and dexterity rolls. He was unable to defeat the four bug guards, and he succumbed to his injuries. Unfortunately, he will not be able to carry on the Ripley tradition because in this darkened room, he died silently because, as you know, in space, no one can hear you scream. Now, had he defeated the four guards, he would have rolled for loot. And the way that works is on a roll of one through five, you get that many coins or credits. If he would have rolled a six, he would have rolled... A second d6 roll on the items chart and a roll two through six would have given him a piece of equipment which may have helped him with his life I did use the stim kit and I mistakenly said in the last video that would increase your life points by six that is not true it is a 1d6 roll I did use that it just basically pro prolonged the inevitable and as I said he succumbed to his injuries now had he com uh, completed the room along with rolling for credits we would have chosen a door rolled on the door to see what the status of the door was and you know the doorway can be unlocked stuck uh, excuse me unlocked stuck locked or malfunction and you would have to perform various stat checks to get through that door and you would then roll for the next room size and continue on until you eventually meet all the monsters or in this case aliens at least once and then the bug queen which would have been a very formidable opponent with a life force of 25 points so that's where it stands for rex he uh doesn't even get a burial because he's just uh, lying dead in this derelict ship uh had he survived you could use that character in another scenario or another module uh Micro RPG and Noah Patterson have a lot of different modules for the system. Uh, some of them are sci-fi, horror. Uh, you also have some uh, post-apocalyptic type scenarios with zombies and the like. And of course, the traditional fantasy setting. Now, in the previous video, I stumbled through trying to explain uh, the various additions of these rules. It seems to me what happened is... This game became much more popular quicker than Noah Patterson expected, and he was trying to keep up with uh, the requests from various players on, you know, making some changes and additions to the game. And you know what? I decided to stop talking about that, and I will place a link in the video description for this video. That will lead to a video from Noah Patterson that explains it much better than I can. So, uh, like I said before, I have purchased the basic edition rules, and this is the 1.75 edition, and also, like I said, after discussing things with Mr. Patterson, I'm going to wait on the deluxe edition, I'll purchase a physical copy, and we'll dig deeper into the system when I have that in my hands. So that should be this summer, hopefully. But whenever it is, we'll take a look at it. So, you know, a great little system. Uh, these modules are nice for a quick uh, role-playing game uh, session. And uh, like I said, if you're lucky enough that your character can survive, you can utilize him in any one of the other um, scenarios or modules because they are interchangeable. They all do work with each other regardless of what version it is. Uh, you might just have to make a few little tweaks. That really is going to depend on which version you end up using as your basis for the rules. 
but overall a great little system that I enjoy very much and I'm looking forward to the deluxe edition coming out sometime later this year hopefully this summer but that's going to do it for this after action report and wrap I'll be back again sometime in the near future with another bantam battle until then take care